them as the fiend falls with pure luck, a faint hope which hopefully blossoms. opens up for the hue to kill the two of them. Um, do I want to stun? No, you're already surprised. Let's go for damage. Four to nine. Press this advantage. Yes. Give them oh, no quarter. So good. Okay, let's hew. Have you experimented with grave robbers? So far, I find it really cool in the back line. Um, I'm actually the same there, Infinite Drill Works. I like grave robbers and particularly in the back line as well, yeah. I mean, the pick to the face sounds cool, but the other skills are. I'm, I'm a big fan of those. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Bulimic again with all the leprosy, you're really letting yourself go. It's, it's just stress beaten. eating, Vayden. Just stress eating. Big fan of those, particularly since they have the stress throws, right? Oh, and a pull, that is also not a good idea, particularly for him. Okay, uh, I want to get the blight up on both of them. Perfect. Now I'm fine with actually hewing them. A devastating yes. blow. That's gonna be so valuable. Now. Uh, let's see if I can switch you around here, because I need you in the back two. Um, I, I built that guy for the back two rows. Now, do I just go for the kill, or do I go for the debuff? Let's mark the repost. I attack you, and hope that they attack me, and I can do repost. Lunge is his second damage skill on the Grave Robber. I haven't actually played that much with Lunge. Okay. Mm, I'm fine not just blasting them. Let's get a stun in. So one perfect. He'll die from Blight anyway, and I want him out of running for the moment. And I want you to be healed if all possible. I think I have a heal for you, right? A self heal. No. Let's uh, go in for a crush of this. Because I was hoping then to do a heal on both of them. Um, let's, let's get a party heal? No, we're going to focus heal you. Love having a leper with specialized items that kind of. Hmm, yeah, I, I, this is what I love. The hue is so powerful. And the self heal, which I also could have used just now, I'm realizing. Fine. Push and pull all you want, buddy. I'm fine with that. This gives me more time to heal everyone up. Um, yeah, I don't want to kill you right now. I want to spend a little bit of time healing. And there we go. Perfect. Seize this momentum. Um, Push on to the tasks and I think we're we're fine. Let's continue for the for the time being. Um, fub, fub, the, the reason why you want to attack the corpse sometimes is, um, if you look at this, the leper, uh, you have those two dots, right? So the leftmost, the white dots, on the right side indicate that he can use the skill only if he's in first or second place. The second one, the reds, the two reds on the front say that he can only attack the first and second place of the enemy row with that. So if you have two corpses here and the enemies are over here, the leper can't attack them. So that's why you want to kill a corpse over here so that they shift forward, and then you can attack them again. So it's all about positioning. Hmm, nice. Um, I think this party is a mixed level right now. Uh, Vaynan is level 1, Hikar is level 2, um, Leonor is level 1, and Baum is level 2. I'm trying to level up a couple of my guys. Let's see how far I can stretch this. I'm a little bit concerned about... Oh, also, let's... 
I'm a little bit concerned about um, Hikar and the stress level, as well as uh, Baum's stress level, but I think I can make it one more um, combat round. Wait, what? Oh no! Brenda's lever, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's that's a funny one, isn't it? It's just I'm not that good at lepering just yet. I have most of my limbs. Okay, I really need to make sure to shift you backwards. Um, see, see, uh, there you can see Fub Fub right now. He cannot use his crush because he is in third place and crush is only second or first place. Let's do a bellow, a debuff on everyone. Start shifting, you people. You can view them. Nice. Okay, yeah, uh, this is definitely my last fight. I definitely need to get out of this dungeon. Oh! Because Hikar is not doing well. Had a roller coaster fight against the Sonos Prophet to be a level two party. Ah, oh, even a drill works. I'm, I'm. Oh, I need a heal. I'd love to move him backwards, but I just really need a heal. Um, let's guard him. I'm, I'm. Uh, I think the Sonos Prophet is next up. I don't. I, I'm 100% blind in this game. This is my first playthrough, so I don't know. But I have seen the Sonos Prophet on the list of uh, next adventures. Yes, hew them down. There we go. Mark for the repost. Let's uh, shift you back again. Just for the safety's sake. Let's get a plague made up for the kill. Ah, oh, yes, the Vestal stays Success strong. We so did it. Clearly in view. Or is it merely Okay, we're out of, of here. The, the Vestal, far too damaged, far too stressed. Way too dangerous. More bones return to rest. Devils remanded Give me to that their cash. Abyss. Give me that cash. I think I probably didn't make good on my investment, but at the very least, this is important. Level threes, that is what I needed. Fortunately, definitely going to need to send them to de-stress, but... Ah, no, Leandre. Let's click on melee, warns, that's always good. Come on, bow. Cove Scrounger. Oh, oh, this replaces things. Oh, I didn't know that. So there's a max of quirks that they can have. That's why you Curiosity, need to lock them in. Interest and obsession. Mile markers on my road to damnation. <laughs> Disease treatments. Good, good, good. You're going blind as well, by the way. Uh, with your secrets, I like having the stun ability. Wouldn't you want the Leprous Corpse Cleaning skill if you already have one? Um, I don't know. I haven't looked that much at the Lepers, really, these skills. Play with all corpses. The Purge, you mean. Once again, is it the Vestal Seeker? Oh, what, what's the... Oh, wait, Seekers is the general name, right? Hey, Ghost. I need a ghost character. I think I do, don't I? It's Here's the problem, though, Ghost. Um, I have a lot of new people that could be in here, except my roster is full. It's kind of annoying, because if I look at this, uh, I can only... Ooh, an Arbalest. I haven't seen you before. Wait, sorry. That, focus, focus. I can get more heroes in, but I need 12 deeds and crests before I can... Uh, upgrade this, so I kind of need to do a different type of quest before I can get one. Now, what is an Arbalest? Better damage against marked. You can mark a target yourself. Okay, that's cool. Knockback, that's nice. 
Extra heals? Whoa, you can heal yourself and get extra heals? That is cool. Clear mark target? That's useful. Huh. They actually look pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna need deeds and crests. Secret arms, the one with the eye patch. Oh, um, eye patch. Man at arms. What were you saying there? Um, you like having the stun ability for your man at arms. Oh, rampart. A knockback and a stun. That's pretty cool. I, I, so far, I'd like this actually. The protection is really good for an ally. I like the general debuff. And I kind of like the retribution as well. Because it's a it's a good taunt sort of thing. But I I could see doing this, yeah, to get a good stun and a knockback in. Ghost, I could let some of them go actually. Um particularly the the abominations I'm not that much of a fan of yet. Could let myself go, obviously. Ah, oh, Hellion has been good to me so far. The Arbalest mainly backline damage dealer with some healing, but if it gets caught out of position, it's useless. Yeah, I can see that. Skaparmal, good to see you again, buddy. How are you doing? Okay, let's get uh, Sergnum some healing now. The debuff resist is... Oof. But the stress damage. We, we, we can't have you stressing out all the time. Now, rabies I'm fine with, actually. The extra damage is pretty fun. Um, I haven't done that much camping, but it's going to be important in the long run. But let's uh, let's try and de-stress some people right now, particularly Hikar. Obsessed with sainthood, huh, Hikar? How about you? Oh, that's expensive. Who else do we need to de-stress? Can we sort by stress? There we go. Bam. Do you have a? Necessity, neither of you have a necessary heal. So might as well go for a cheaper one. Gambling? No, all of them are expensive. Okay. That means that prayer is still the cheapest that I have. Fish OP? Absolutely vampiric fish. Heals only for other people, not yourself. For medium long missions, he has a 35% heal skill for an entire party. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Need a jester to compensate for extra stress abominations cause. Really now, Victor? Okay. Do I have a jester? I don't. Huh. Okay, I have to look into getting a jester then, maybe. Because I have these two abominations, but... Um, there we go. But I haven't used them that much. Let's see, I already have a couple of level 3 characters. Once they're rested up, I think I have a full level 3 party that I can send out and do more complex things. Right now then, I want deeds and I want crests. Um, do I have anyone who just recently became level 2? I kind of need to upgrade Leandre. Um, and Latvian, come to think of it. Now, I like the Throne Dagger. It's good in combination with um, the, the Hound Master, because you can mark easily. I don't think there's a skill to mark yourself. I kind of want to remove the pick to the face and have something else. This might be good, actually. Extra speed, extra dodge. I like a good... See, I keep her in the back. So, I mean, Flashing Daggers is really the only one that that applies next to Toxin Trickery. Hey, Hothor. d and is complete. Welcome back out of Lurk Mode, then. Collecting microcredit loan. His 20-year-old son is called Byron. <laughs> uh, Byronic, it's always the best. You won't fund this loan, otherwise the choice would be easy. <laughs> well, well, you know, you shouldn't let that influence uh, the decision-making too much, even though it is awesome. 
Okay, I like those. I very much like those, actually. Let's level you up massively. Now, lunge. I'm actually okay with lunge, yeah. But I haven't used it that much, so... Oh, wait. Um, Leandre was also rare for level up. Let's try that rampart. I like a knockback, and I like a stun. Let's level that up. Um, let's see. I'm a big fan of the bellow. And of that one. Let's let's make sure not to spend too... Actually, I kind of spend too much. Okay, I want deeds and I want crests. Deeds. Okay. Gives me an arbalest skill. That's not that interesting. And an extra deed. A Hellene one. Extra HP. Less stun resist, though. Let's go for it. Okay, um, who do we put in here? We want to level people. We want to level Vampiric Fish. Level myself. Level Latvian. Who else do we want to level? Leandre, really, but... Um hey, Infinite Drillworks, thank you very much for logging in. I really appreciate it. Lovely having you in chat. I hope to see you again sometime. You have a great night. An occultist might be interesting. Oh, he can mark targets. Hello, hello, hello. How about we get Yamato in on this? 90% of rooms. This seems good. Provision, you babies. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I did not notice that was a medium. They're both mediums. Fine. Fine, we're gonna have to get going anyway. Um, let's get 12 torches, 16 food, um, 3 shovels, 2 skeleton keys. There we go, that should be good. You've added a corrupt blacksmith crest, uh, an ignorant priest with a mind for conversation, <laughs> conversion to the Eldritch, and misunderstood undead minions actually fighting the Eldritch influence. Nice, 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 nice. Ghost, I do need a jester. Yeah, apparently. Didn't know that was that good for stress relief, but that might be interesting. Okay, let's give this a try. I can always um, escape out anyway. Perhaps a Byronic gamer character can be sacrificed to make room for a ghost. <laughs> uh. I knew all these paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. Let's burn 90% of rooms. And of course there's a little annoying thing we have to go here. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 9, 13. 90% of 13, that does mean at least uh, 9 rooms, 9 and 3, yeah, 12 rooms, so that there's no escaping it. I'm going to have to go here anyway. Might as well start and then move back quickly. Ew. Nature herself, a victim to the spreading corruption, malformed with misintent. <laughs> Entire town undead its evil sway. Yeah, that sounds good, Hoth. That sounds good. Holy water from mummified remains. Ah. I need to learn so much about these. I, I, I should have. As the light gains should purchase, have maybe chosen characters that had and purpose is made what? clear that had no stress whatsoever on a medium trip um, let's see oh you can pick to the face already uh, let's wait what are your damages you are blight resistant and bleed resistant oh I only have eight damage though okay eight eight health their formation nice. is broken. Maintain the offensive. Okay, so bleed's not gonna do that much. Might as well start marking targets from the start. 
get that debuff in. Um, stun, are you 50-50 on stuns? Let's start bleeding out. Confidence surges nice. as the enemy crumbles. Now stun's okay, but sacrificial stab. Extra damage against Eldritch, and you are Eldritch. Nice. Although I was gonna do a really nice Ghostbusters reference there. Let's rush. Yeah, let's do that. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Your face when there's no point buying the Star Wars humble bond with the majority owned over games. Aww, is a slow and insidious killer. It's a pretty good bundle though if you don't have the games. Ancient coffin. It's just um, let's get the occultist in. Whoa, wheeled explorer. Don't mind if I do. Hey there, Jexes. Good to see you. How are you doing? Your character has been a badass in this game. You've really been developing into awesomeness. Ooh. Now that is lucky. Um, let's see, you're vulnerable. You're not that vulnerable to bleed. But you don't have that many hit points either. Let's uh, mark that guy so that our grave robber can hopefully do good damage. Five to twelve. Continually onslaught. It Destroy is Tejexus. It is indeed Tejexus. How much damage does that do? Two to four. That is not enough for me. Four to seven, though. Get that murder in. Uh, let's try for a stun. Oh, 100%. Never mind. Wicked hack. Which is a guaranteed kill. As the fiend falls. A faint hope blossoms. But while Jexus appears, it's super not effective. Nah, just kidding. Sorry, Jexus. You're fine. Oh, Halter, you are right. The Jexus mount, of the Rimworld so fame. That was. Resistance. It was just amazing. That Jexus was just an inspiration to all future Jexuses. I think, though, that Rimworld game has influenced every character on this computer who has the name Jexes, because now all of them end up being badasses. Loot, nice. Shovel, perfect, I needed that. You deserve that of all the stuff you pulled in yesterday's stream. Ah, yesterday's stream was a lot of fun. We should do that more often, actually. Those types of, uh... Ooh, room battle with treasure. Those types of, uh, fun doubles. Triples, actually. Since, of course, uh, Savannah was there as well. Go for it. <laughs> no matter how good it gets, it's all downhill. Halt or have faith. Have faith. Remember, I, I finished all the Dark Souls. It was all about faith. Get that uh, mark in on you in the back. So that our grave robbers can start doing some damage. Now you are vulnerable to bleed, so let's get a let's get a Hound's Harry and Harry all of you. And we'll get a thrown dagger on the mark in the back. Precision and power. Oh yeah, it was great, Jexus. It was indeed. Um, can I stun you? you? Yeah, let's try. Shout at them, Vampiric. For all the stuns. Yeah, there are a lot of mods in there today. Good point. Okay, let's get let's try for more stun maybe. Come on. Stun him. Yes. Okay, can I stab you? You are Eldridge. Four to eight, three to six. Let's just try and outright stab you. Ah, this is what I was afraid of. That um, that Latvian would be next. I was hoping that I could mark. 
Still though, um, three to eight. Three to eight. Let's just give it a go. Ah. Well, still, one damage per round, he's gonna die anyway. Um, let's try and target Whistle to make sure that the Grave Robber has a good mark target for the weapon next time. That cuts on its own. It's all about strength, not faith. Okay, I could maybe extra damage against Mark. Let's do it myself. So we need to start getting them down quickly. Now this is extra damage against Mark. That means he dies next turn. Let's get you extra damage against Eldridge. Or we could mark someone. Okay, Vampiric, show your murder skills. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Undertale 2, stay awesome. Was that the party Stinson edition? I used to play Undertale 1. I was bad at it. And it just became awesome. True story. Deeds, excellent. We need those. Brought low and driven into the mud. Now I'm gonna do this to guarantee myself. Oh, you lied to me, chat. You said if I used a key on an unlocked box, I would guarantee results. Okay, let's uh, move back swiftly. I'm gonna save up on the light a little bit, since we're not gonna get any encounters here. Undertale 2. I wouldn't be surprised that they were working on it, given the uh, the success that Undertale has had. I think it was very much a streamer graded. Hey, what's that battle? Why is there a battle there? I didn't know they could show up again. Huh, that's cool. Okay, uh, in that case, let's get a poison dart in the back there, because a blanket fire will really start harming me if I don't get rid of them quickly. Um, I can stun them. Mark them. No, let's let's start. I have a bleed skill. He needs to be in the back. Oh, oh wait, that's his heal. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, let's just damn, try and get some uh, murder in because I need the black fire gone as soon as possible, particularly since I don't have a vestal right now. Ah, oh, yes. Okay, let's um. I'm just gonna mark. It would be good to mark, but I let's go for the bleeds. I need to make sure to get a lot of them down. We'll go AoE. We'll, we'll go for AoE attempt. Uh, let's see. Let's try and stun them. I love it how Vampiric even sounds like a demon when he just growls at them. Pick to the face might be good, but I want to get that done. This has a chance of murdering him. He gets five damage next turn. So whatever he does, he dies. He's dead anyway, so perfect. Oh, that damage. I need to move him a little bit to the back so he can start doing his, uh, his randomized heals. Get a bleed out on you, maybe. Nice. That'll kill him next round. A slow death, unforeseen, unforgiving. Yeah, I, I need to start moving him to the back for that weird reconstruction. Let's uh, let's swap. The downside is that'll negate some of your skills, which I'm not happy with. Uh, let's mark that guy. So that the Grey Robber can hopefully use death by inches. some of those extra skills. 
Throne Dagger. Extra damage against Mark. 